We talk a lot at Family Financial Partners about organizing your financial life. That's at the core of what we do on a daily basis for our client families. We help people understand where their money is, where it's going, and the why behind it. You see, organizing can be an overwhelming task for a lot of folks. And we find that it's often helpful to have an outside party actually sit down with you, take an objective view, and make recommendations on how to move forward. Now you may be wondering how exactly we go about actually organizing someone's financial life. Well, that's a good question. So let me just tell you a few of the ways we do this. First, maybe obviously, we communicate. Yes, communication is really key to almost anything in life, and if you ask any of our clients about their first meeting with us, they'll tell you it involved a lot of talking and a lot of questions. We sit down with all potential clients and go over everything that they've got, from how much they spent on groceries or clothes last month, to what kind of home they envision living in during retirement, to what shaped their values and approach to money. And while this meeting can take a couple hours, the more we know about your money, and your values, the better we can organize your finances in a way that's tailored to you. From there, then we create a customized financial planning checklist. And for each client who comes on board with us, we create a to-do list. It's organized by priority, and it helps you easily work through and check off those to-dos as you navigate the planning process. This checklist includes things like, what are your emergency fund goals, maybe tips such as double checking the accuracy of your social security report to make sure the income's correct, monthly retirement contributions, insurance recommendations, and much more, all of course individually created for you and your particular situation. Now, we then help everyone keep everything in a safe, easy to access place. See, we use a software called eMoney. It's a secure software tool that houses all financial information from your accounts, to documents, to insurance information. And this helps you see at a glance where you are and what effects today's decisions could have on your future goals. In other words, should you buy the Winnebago or not? Should you buy the beach house or not? In short, staying, by staying organized and aggregating all this financial information into one place, we're able to help you stay informed and make smart decisions. We also hold our clients accountable, which is key to staying organized. Everyone knows how easy it is to set a goal on or a New Year's resolution, only to fall off the proverbial wagon a month or two later. And it's our job to help you stick to your goals and stay accountable to them. Monthly cash flow budgeting today helps you stay on track with your retirement goals, even if you're still years from retirement will help you see how those pieces fit together to form a big picture and help you stay on the path to get there. We find that many clients from time to time will just get derailed simply because they actually just stop paying attention. They just don't open the envelopes, they don't open the mail, they don't look at the accounts. Well, we can help you keep you in the know of what's going on with your money. We also know that we can't do it all. Financial planning is not about managing an investment portfolio and leaving clients to their own devices for every aspect of their money. We're always here to answer questions and adjust plans according to how life changes for you or new goals that you add. But we'll also help you find a CPA who fits your personality and a state attorney who specializes in your area of concern or any other professional that you may need when your questions fall outside our areas of expertise. We maintain relationships with many professionals, in fact, in the community here that we live in, and we feel very confident in recommending them to you. And the professionals we refer our clients to aren't always in the financial industry per se. We've recently heard from a few folks that their homes are causing them stress due to a lack of organization and order, just too much clutter. So we spoke with Christy Sharp of Lady Cat Organizing recently to get her take on helping her clients get organized. And just as our team starts with finding out where everything is in the, our clients' financial lives, Christy has her clients sort everything into categories before d diving into the actual organization. And of course, they only organize what they're actually going to keep, she explained to us. So whether it's Goodwill, your Aunt June, or simply putting something in the trash, Establishing those categories of stuff to get rid of is the very first step. 
Christy also recommends focusing on one room at a time before redistributing household items to where they'll be the most functional. And of course, just as each financial planning client is unique, each of Christie's clients has unique needs as well. Some struggle with sentimental items. You know, I found that on a beach. It's a rock, but I found it on a beach. Some struggle with uh, things that, you know, like are overstuffed closets and, and maybe they don't even know what they actually own, while others hang on to things that they think that they might need someday down the road. I mean, you can never have too much Tupperware or cottage cheese containers. Mom. <laughs> They're on all different levels of organizing all aspects of your life. And sometimes a nudge from a neutral party is all that it takes. So we'd love to help you and your friends and family get organized when it comes to your money or your life. Give us or Christy a call today.